Hey there, welcome back to Lima Bean Living. In today's video, I will be reviewing an awesome car that we got for Aubrey and sharing all of the info you need if you are considering getting one of these for your littles. So let's get into this. If you are new here, hello, my name is Emily. Welcome to my motherhood channel where I take care of all things mom. I am due with my second child any day now, so you can imagine entertaining my three-year-old is quite exhausting. So this car arrived just in time. Look at my shoes on! Okay, Aubrey, come look at your surprise. What? What's these two tires? Aubrey helped her daddy set up the car by removing the plastic wrap and handing him the parts. And Juan did record the entire setup process using his GoPro. So if you want to see that footage, I can always upload another video from Juan's perspective. The entire process took about 40 minutes for just Juan to do, even though the instructions said it would probably take an hour for two people to set up. So, you know, take that for what it's worth. Tell me what you think about your new car. It's fun. Can I turn on the light there? Yeah, you can turn on the light. <gasps> and they actually change colors. It's too bright out here to really see, but turn it back on. Wow. Okay, open the door and get in there. Okay. There it is. It can look. My flip flops are a little bit too big. Okay, you gotta put your seatbelt on. Okay. The ready. Wow. Mommy, ready. You gotta press the gas right there, okay? No, right there on your foot. Whoa. The thing I probably like the most about this car is that I can control the car using the provided remote, at least until I feel Aubrey is coordinated enough to drive the car on her own. The remote is easy to navigate to. There are forwards and backwards buttons, right and left buttons, a park button, and a speed control button. So you can choose either like the faster option or a slower option. When Aubrey is skilled enough to not crash into things, she will be able to control the car using the shifter, which controls whether you go forwards or backwards, the little gas pedal, and the steering wheel. It is worth noting that there is no brake pedal or button for the kids controlling the car on their own, so that's only for the remote control. As far as safety goes, Aubrey is able to buckle herself in using the three-point safety belt, and the car doors also lock into place so they aren't flying around open as she drives. We charge the car fully, which does take about 8 to 12 hours, but we were able to drive it for long periods of time over the course of a few days. One of the main features that we love is the Bluetooth speaker in the car. So as many of my viewers know, Aubrey adores first responders. So to make her driving experience even more special, we played siren sounds from our phone through the car's speakers, and she loved pretending that she was driving off to save the day, as she would say. There are other music options as well. There is an FM radio option, as well as some other songs that are like stored in the car's device. Aubrey also loves controlling the headlights using one of the buttons near the steering wheel. These lights can be solid or flashing and are pretty bright, which is nice, especially if you plan on going on an evening walk with the family. In addition to the car, there is also a cute little shovel that attaches to the back. So if you decide to bring this to a park or the beach, there is an extra built-in toy for your little one to have fun in the sand. I will put the Amazon link to the product below in the description box in case you want to check out the product for yourself. We really love this car and can't wait to see Aubrey drive it in our own backyard. For those of you who are new here, we are waiting for our new build to be finished, so we are kinda in between homes. My hope for our future backyard is to have somewhat of a figure eight path for bike riding, rollerblading, and now little car rides. If my landscaping dream comes true, I think Aubrey and little baby Jack 
will have much more fun on the path rather than traveling back and forth across a single slab of concrete. I'd like to thank McBob for sponsoring today's video and providing us with hours of fun. As I mentioned earlier, this car has also been a big blessing because I can sit down and take it easy while driving Aubrey around the backyard using the remote control. I have a feeling that when baby Jack arrives, this will continue to be a very popular activity for our little family. If you found this video helpful, entertaining, or if you just want to send us some love, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button. If you are new here, I would love for you to stick around and subscribe so you don't miss out on any of the huge changes that are just around the corner. Thanks for watching, and I will catch you in the next one. to the end of the video. If you didn't know already, every Monday and Friday you can find motherhood and lifestyle content on this channel. And since us moms have to do it all, that may mean yummy recipes, easy DIYs, mom hacks, cleaning and organization, or just a combo of everything. Please know that you are loved and you are made for greatness, and I will catch you in the next one.